here is Shabak once more. Dear viewers, don't pay attention to my lighting because I want to show you something here inside. This is uh, my response to one of your questions, which is super important about Super 6 um, EVO carbon frame internal cable routing. It is not defective in any way. As a matter of fact, I'm done routing my shifting cables through the bottom bracket area and it's being done in a very easy and nice way. I like it. But let me just tell you what the question was. Uh, someone told me, Dan, I've seen some Super 6 bikes with the uh, cranks at spindle cut in half by the uh, shifters cable which was touching to the axle. Well, it is not possible if, you see the sticker here, if it's done in the right way. It says here, before uh, routing the cables, read the manual. And I'm gonna just tell you what's, what can be done wrong. And things happen, uh, I just recommend you go back to my uh, episode about 99% of the bikes needs these maintenance tricks because you know some people who assemble those bikes for us or maybe reassemble something maybe your local shop can do the job wrong let me show you what you should inspect i'm just using some additional light here uh, all right we can see the spindle in the bottom bracket area can you see the cable just above it that's the um, black one this is the cable for the rear shifter there is no chance this cable will cut our spindle uh, in a half but uh, if you for some reason remove your uh, crankset and then you for example replace not for example but if you replace the rear shifting um, cable at the same time so if you uh, route the cables and before putting tension on the cable you put the spindle of the crankset back into the bottom bracket uh, you can come up with your uh, cable going under the spindle right so you will need a longer cable for the rear derailleur but if you just replace it with a new so you wouldn't probably notice and the cable will really be rubbing your spindle so make sure guys that your cable uh, has tension on it before you put here uh, the spindle okay uh, there is no braking cable uh, so far uh, but also when we route the brake uh, cable just make sure it is in the right position but i don't think it could be the brake uh, the braking cable um, doing this cut but that cable could do it so I'm just telling you guys so that you don't have to uh, you know send your bike back to Canada saying hey what's wrong with the cable routing just inspect this place make sure that when the spindle comes through your bottom bracket area uh, the cable is already like done assembled fastened and then it works fine if you find it helpful and give me some more info if you had such problems give us uh, give us some feedback about it but there is no absolutely no problem with these frames